silage season is soon upon us. Now is the time to inspect our silage pits. Hello, my name is David Webster from Chagas and I am part of the ASAP advisory program. Today I'm going to talk to you about preparing your silage pit for this season and also the spreading of silage effluent. Firstly, clean the pit and channels. Ideally pressure wash. Identify and repair any cracks, broken concrete, etc. All repair works are to be completed in accordance with the Department of Agriculture specification S128 and S128A. These can be viewed on the Department of Agriculture website. When making silage, ensure all silage is ensiled inside the channels to enable effluent to be collected and directed into the effluent tank. If your pit does not have sufficient capacity, store surplus silage in another suitable pit if you have one, or make it into baled silage. When land spreading silage effluent, dilute the effluent with one part water or slurry to one part effluent. When spreading, check the weather forecast. Do not spread if rain is forecast within the next 24 hours. Do not spread within 5 metres of any water course. In summary, check your pit now for cracks. Make the necessary repairs in accordance with Department of Ag specification S128 and S128A. Keep silage within the channels. Collect and land spread all effluent responsibly in accordance with good farm practice.